before this vlog started, I wanted to quickly do two things. One, I want to do a proper intro because the day that I vlogged, I kind of just jumped right into it while I was at Target shopping. So it was a little weird just jumping right into it when I was at um, Target. I just randomly started talking to you guys. I need to get used to vlogging. I am the worst vlogger. So I want to do a proper intro and then also talk to you guys about a little channel update. Please excuse the mess. I'm in my guest bedroom, but... um. A little channel update so for a while i have been thinking about starting a second channel for so many reasons but i thought i would test it out here on this channel first so my original plan was to start a second channel and i had so many different like names i would call it i don't know but i was thinking about all things bargains bargaining with jillian basically a channel where i go shopping show you guys like sales and clearance do affordable diys basically anything that's going to save you money anything that is bargain or frugal I want it to do. I love doing those types of videos, but I just don't know if I do too many of those videos on this channel, if it'll do well or not. I notice anytime I do any type of like Dollar Tree video or Walmart video, they get probably the most views. So I feel like a lot of you guys do enjoy it, but I know a lot of you guys still enjoy all of my other content, like my cleaning and organizing style videos. So before I even do a whole different channel, I want to test it out first and see if you guys even enjoy that type of content. So what I plan on doing is every Friday, I'm going to upload a like bargain type video. So I think I'm going to call it like frugal Fridays. So basically anything that has to do with bargaining, saving money, stuff like that, I will upload on Friday. So it can be a shop with me where I show you guys a bunch of clearance or sale items. It could be an affordable DIY for your house from like Dollar Tree. I love doing Dollar Tree DIYs. It could be a affordable fashion haul, whether I go in store to like Ross or Walmart or TJ Maxx, or it can be an at home one. Basically anything that is going to be bargain related or frugal. I will do on Fridays. So I'm gonna do this for about a month and then at the end of the month, I will see the feedback and see if you guys enjoy it and if it's something that you guys would be interested in. And then I will go ahead and make my decision from there. I will either um, just keep it like once a week here on this channel and call it Frugal Fridays or if you guys really enjoy it, I will just do another channel where it's dedicated to all affordable, frugal, bargain shopping. But I don't know if I will um, make this channel my bargain channel and then create another channel where I do all of my cleaning, organizing, lifestyle, motherhood style videos, or if I will keep this one, my motherhood lifestyle videos, and then create a different channel for like my bargaining. So I don't know, I'll probably have you guys do like a voting um, type thing where you guys can vote on what you guys think and your ideas. Also leave in the comments what you guys think about it, if it's something you guys would be interested in or not because I just really love those types of videos. I've been wanting to do it for a while. I just don't know if it's something you guys would be interested in. But then I see how well my Dollar Tree videos and my Walmart videos do. So then I'm like, maybe they do like it. I don't know. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. I'm going to start rambling on. But just let me know your thoughts in the comments. Like I said, the next month I'm going to test it out and then I guess I'll just make my decision at the end and then I will have you guys vote in my community tab after a month. I will have you guys vote on what you guys prefer and what you would like and then you guys can also always tell me your thoughts in the comments down below and let me know what you're thinking. But Anyways, guys, enough of my rambling. I've been talking here for a while, so I'm going to go ahead and jump right in to this vlog. This is a vlog where I went shopping for a few hours with my friend while the kids were in school. So it's kind of like a girl's day, and then I did a very, very small haul from the Target things that I bought. So let's go ahead and jump right into this vlog. Hey, guys, so we are at Target shopping, right? We're shopping. Yep. Spending all of our husband's money. So I want to get this shirt. It's Hocus Pocus shirt. I really like it, but it's $15, so I'm not sure. Why does this lighting keep on changing? It keeps on turning me orange, but I'm not sure because I have a lot of other junk in here. And Angie's trying on a bunch of different sweaters. She's getting indecisive. If I buy the Hocus Pocus shirt, you have to buy some clothes too, so I'm not the only one getting trouble buying clothes. Okay. <laughs> and then after this, we're gonna go to Trader Joe's. Oh look, vacation mode. We need to buy this. We need to buy this shirt and then go on vacation and leave the husbands behind with the kids. Girls vacation. But I thought I would just vlog a little bit today because I haven't vlogged for a really long time and I have a lot of errands to run today. So Target, grocery store, Trader Joe's, get that. But I have a bunch of stuff in here for the kids. I'm gonna get Ryan this little monster, little, I think it's only a dollar. It's just like an activity book. And then guys, they have so many cute things. So like these knee high socks I'm gonna get for Madison. I might do a little haul once I get home. All black. Now you're really indecisive. Hey, it goes with your outfit right now. <laughs> Where are we, Angie? What is this place called? We are at the Forum. 
for them. We're gonna act like we're rich and that we can afford everything in this Tessa, but we wanna go to Trader Joe's before we do. We're gonna walk around the shops and see what we can find. There's a Bath and Body Works, a Home Goods. Definitely wanna go in there. And then there's a chocolate place. I'm thinking about getting some chocolate for Robert. What's this place, Jason's Deli? And I think there's a field trip here because there's a school bus. Is there stores around here? And I just tried for the first time a pumpkin spice latte, but mine, I got mine with almond milk because I can't have regular whole milk. And it actually tastes really good. I liked it. I didn't think I was going to like it, but it's really good. What are you doing? Setting an alarm. <laughs> okay, we're setting an alarm so that we don't forget the kids. I have to be at Ryan's school by like 2.15 to be able to get Madison on time. And we're what, like 30, 40 minutes away from home? What's this place? We're going to Oh, it's cold in here. We're in Swoozies. I don't know what this place is, but it's really cute. Oh my God, look at the rugs. Look, look how cute. Where's the party with alcohol? That is so cute, you guys. All this would be perfect for the Halloween party. Angie. All that would be perfect for the Halloween party. I got a bunch of these cups for them, that company. Yeah. Is that the same? No, it's not oh. the same company, but like, it's similar. Yeah. That one's really cute. Did you get one of these? What's that? It's like a oh, champagne flute. I, have, I got a champagne flute, but it's much bigger than that. And it holds bubbles too. It doesn't go flat. Kids section. Ryan would love this. Look at this book bag. Oh, is that a lunchbox? It's really cute in here. I've never been in this store. They have a ton of stuff. I try to get those for Madison because they say it's good sensory, but she tries to eat it. Yeah. So, oh, look, magnet jigsaw. <laughs> See, that's why I don't buy it for the kids. Wine freeze cooling cup, so it keeps your wine nice and cold. I like my wine to be chilled, a little cold. See, perfect. They are fifteen dollars. They're so cute. You have it in pink and in this color as well. Place now, you guys, and look at how huge that pumpkin is. It's all chocolate. They also have chocolate apples. Oh my god. I'm gonna get that chocolate man for Robert. <laughs> you are the winner. A strawberry covered dark chocolate. Angie loves me, so she got me some chocolate covered strawberries. You want yours now or you want to save it? Uh, are you gonna eat yours now? I'm gonna eat mine now. Yeah. I'll eat mine now. You wanna sit? for a second and then I got Robert some fudge I'm a nice wife and I buy him fudge with his he's lucky <laughs> with, his he own money. with his own money I buy him fudge with his own money <laughs> all right all right I'll show Angie eating hers <laughs> really good. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have chocolate almond tea. Oh. <laughs> so we just left at Bath and Body Works. Angie went to go run and get the car because we're going to walk over to Trader Joe's, but we want to get the car a little bit closer. But we went to Bath and Body Works and I just got a few hand sanitizers. The one I had on my bag currently was completely out and I've been meaning to go and I haven't so we just went there um i don't know where else there's a home goods we want to run into really quickly so i'll probably go in there and then trader joe's and then get lunch and then it'll be time to head back home to get the kids from school it is so hot you guys it's fall but it's like 94 degrees outside i'm ready for fall weather but me and angie have decided that we're going to tell our husbands once a month they need to give us a hundred dollar limit we're going to spend a day just us hanging out either go get our nails or toes done lunch and shopping because I think we deserve it and we never do anything for ourselves so self-care is important so we're gonna tell our husbands that today let's see what they think about it but we really don't ever do anything for ourselves so I think $100 a month is good so that that'll be our little allowance but anyways I'm gonna wait for Angie over here she's getting the car and everyone's looking at me looking crazy but look how pretty this shopping plaza it's so pretty I'll turn the camera around so you guys so can see. shopping plaza is so cute but like 40 minutes from our house so that's why we barely come but it's really cute it has so many different shops and stuff once it gets cooler it's gonna be really nice to walk around here so we are now in home goods 
we're gonna look around before going to Trader Joe's on the phone. Listening to, oh look at the cups. I want some new like wine glasses. That'd be kind of different cups. They have so much Halloween decor out. I want it all. I wait, do not hit me in the head with it. <laughs> well, if you want to get your water in to make sure, you can just put it in there. Those are huge. I actually probably should get something like this because to make sure I'm drinking enough water in a day. But I like this. I have so many of these. It's ridiculous. Robert says that my collection is getting out of control. Yes. But I like it. Whoa, is that bigger than this one? Yes. Oh. Oh. I want one of these cups in like the little lunch boxes. Right, guys. <laughs> That's a workout just holding that. I'm gonna, gonna get it in there. Angie's crazy. Is that like a water bottle? What no, is it? It's a water bottle. There's a pocket bottle. How much are these? I want to buy a bunch of different organizers. <laughs> Seriously. These are $7. She, she lost another tooth. I saw that. And she has picture day on Monday. I like I like these trays. Look, oh, I thought this was gonna be like marble. It's seven dollars, not marble. I don't know what material that is. We're in the clearance aisle right now because that's all we can afford. What are you looking at? Are those cups? Yeah, coffee mugs. They have some food on sale. They're probably about to expire or already expired. Oh, this is cute. It's a piggy bank. More water cups. <laughs> Eighteen dollars. And that's on sale. It's another workout one. This one would not be as easy. Oh, look how cute this is. The kids need a new step stool for the bathroom. The one they have now is so old. How much is this one? Why should not be in clearance? Watch the one I have just. Oh my god. I am not strong enough for this. Okay. It is on clearance. $18. It's so cute, but Ryan would be like, extra girls even though we have madison madison another one of these seats the one she has now is all messed up and she loves it they're 25 here i don't know how much i got it for i got this mine at target or walmart but she loves them or get her a huge one like that she can throw herself on she likes like stuff like that she's always throwing herself on it one of those i have um that one's the elephant my pottery barn one. you're gonna give me a pottery barn one <laughs> Only Did you decorate outside? I haven't decorated outside. I'm, to... I'm scared to put a real pumpkin out. I'm scared it's going to get rotten because it's so hot outside. We have a lot of cute stuff. Oh, look. A witch lives here with her little monsters. Oh my god, you scared me. Hi guys, so it is so much later. It is like 7 p.m. at night, but really quickly, I wanna show you guys a few things that I picked up today. So when we went to Bath and Body Works, I went in there because I needed some hand sanitizers. So I grabbed five, I think they were five or seven dollars. I already put one on my purse because the one in my purse was already empty. So I got two of this one. I don't really know what it's called. I feel like I always mispronounce it, but I got two of these. The other one I already put on my purse. It smells really good. And then I got two of the um, Rose Water and Ivy just because that is my favorite scent currently still from Bath and Body Works. Even though it says Bride Tribe, I don't care. I'm obsessed with this scent. And then the last scent I got, it just says, thanks for everything. And this is Sugared Clementine. And that one smells really good as well. So those are the five things um, or five any backs that I got. And then I was gonna pick up like candles and hand soaps, but I have a few candles already and hand soaps, so I decided not to. And from Home Goods, I only picked up one thing, which was some hangers for Madison because she was out of hangers that I've been having to use Ryan's. So these are just like a um, very light purple, probably like a lilac purple, and it comes at 25 for only $10. So I grabbed those and those are the velvet ones. And then from Target, I got a bunch of like cleaning stuff you guys are not going to be interested in. I also got the mom scent and Mrs. Myers, which is my favorite scent. I found it, but I already put all that away. But I also got the kids these light up necklaces I thought they could use for Halloween. So I got Madison the cat 
And then I got Ryan the pumpkin and they do light up. So on Halloween, they can wear these. And also for Ryan, I got this really cute like little drink cup. This was only a dollar and it says trick or treat. I didn't get one for Madison because this is glass and she throws everything. So every time she's done drinking something, she literally chucks it across the room. So she cannot have glass. Um, Ryan, I'm even a little nervous giving him glass, but he's a little more careful. So I just got him this, which was only a dollar. I thought it was really cute. And then talking about Halloween, I got Madison these kids tights. I thought they were really cute. They just have a bunch of like pumpkins all over it. And this was $3 from a dollar spot. Then I also got her these knee-high socks. I thought they were just so cute. So got her those. I also just got myself some mascara. This is one of my favorite drugstore mascaras. It works really, really well. And then I also got Ryan this. It's called my Monster Sticker Activity Book. So this was only a dollar. I also got Madison one, but she's already playing with it. She doesn't really know how to do the activities and stuff, but she just likes to like scribble and draw in it. And then sometimes she likes to play with the stickers. So she found hers in the bag and I tried to take it from her so I can show you guys and she started screaming. So I just gave it back to her. But that's the last thing I bought from Target other than the cleaning stuff. That's not interesting. But anyways, I'm going to close out this vlog because like I said, it's already seven o'clock. I had to put the kids to bed and start cooking dinner for me and Robert. Tonight we're going to have tacos because apparently it's National Taco Day. So that's going to end it for today's vlog. So I'm pretty sure I don't have enough footage to make this into one vlog. Maybe I do. I'm not sure. I might vlog one more time next week and combine it. Not 100% sure, but just in case I don't vlog um, next week, I just want to close out the vlog. So I just want to say thank you so much for watching today's vlog. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you haven't already. I would love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. As always, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.